Sorry, I, I feel like I didn't do enough commentary last time. I wanted to talk a little more. Um, I got a few really good pictures that I wanted to talk about. Um, so, in my last wall display video, I mentioned that I did a couple of Mr. Rogers pictures right there. Now, I don't watch Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood as often as I used to, but I do, I do still sometimes do Mr. Rogers' fan art, and especially that one that's perfect for October because the Superheroes Week traditionally aired in October. Uh, speaking of Mr. Rogers, I wanted to tell you guys, um, I have nothing cut in stone yet, but I was thinking in the next few months, um, God willing, I was thinking, uh, since we did 55th anniversary fan art for Mr. Rogers, I might do, uh, a poster, not just a small picture, but a poster of... Uh, some of the Sesame Street Muppets for Sesame Street's 55th anniversary coming next year. Now, I do not watch Sesame Street as an adult. I I don't watch Sesame Street, but I did used to watch Sesame Street all the time when I was a little kid. As you can clearly see, I got a Sesame Street satire cartoon right up there. So it's still a huge part of my childhood, obviously. Oh, something else I just want, I, I wanted to tell you guys. I just recently found this out. Um, I just read online something kind of upsetting, not too surprising, but kind of upsetting regarding Sesame Street. Again, this is not too surprising, but I was kind of shocked to learn this. But um, I read that uh, Alan, Alan Marioka, is literally the only Sesame Street human cast member left from my childhood that's still on the show today. He was introduced in 1998. Uh, he's still there 25 years later. He's the only one left. Literally everybody else that I knew on the show is no longer on Sesame Street. Now, this is not too surprising because, of course... Um, as a lot of us may know, a lot of the main adult cast members on Sesame Street left in the mid-tweens. Uh, Maria in 2015, and Gordon, Susan, Bob, and Luis in 2016. Um, I, I actually had no idea that Gabby and Miles were no longer on the show. That was news to me. But even... But but even more surprising than that, Gina, Gina, one of my favorite Sesame Street human characters when I was a kid, she's no longer on the show. And that's interesting because I did this She Stoogies cartoon, not She Stoogies cartoon, well it is inspired by the Free Stoogies, but this Sesame Street satire cartoon, this features uh, Allison Bartlett O'Reilly as Gina. And also features Henrietta Honker. I had no idea Gina wasn't on the show anymore. She left in 2015. She uh, was on the show since she was on the show since 1986. Now, she, she actually started out as a teenager, believe it or not. But yeah, that's Gina and Henrietta Honker in this Sesame Street satire. I had no idea Gina wasn't on the show anymore. This is news to me. Like I said, I don't watch Sesame Street as an adult, so I don't follow what goes on now. I just know like a lot of the a lot of the major adult cast members that were there from early on left the show. I didn't know that uh, Gina was one of them. So yeah, a bit of a surprising shock for my childhood there. Yeah, just thought that was interesting to share with you guys. Just in case any of you remember watching Sesame Street when you were little. And I guess that wraps up another wall display video. Thanks for watching again.